First of all, we're going to check that the flow sensor has been calibrated. So I go to system setup, calibration. To calibrate those, I just pull this out at the side there. There you go. And you'll see that you get those two yellow signs up the top there. Yeah. All right, so I'll push them back in. That's now calibrated. And then the next thing we're going to do is calibrate the airway gas. So we're going to hit that there. So just going to connect that up to our test cylinder. It's got a mixture of gases and it tells you the concentration. So CO2, and okay. types of oxygen, nitrous, and agent as well. So there's a, there's a yes. test cylinder. Yeah, it's yeah, it's yeah. pre-calibrated. Correct. It's got exactly the right combination. Yeah. So it's now telling me to feed the gas. So I'll just flick the regulator there. And you'll see that on the waveform, you'll see that you get the uptick there, so the gas is feeding for about five seconds or so, and then it'll tell me to turn that off in a minute. So now we're going to check the calibration. So that's 5.07. So I just need to just reduce that a little bit there to 5.01. Nice. Next one's 55 for the oxygen. So I'll just lock that in. Yep. Nitrous 33%. There you go, and that's your gas calibration done. And that is for this machine. Look at this sign here that's telling you to turn the machine off and on again. They like to be turned on, on again every 12 hours. They run their own internal checks. You just turn it off, like 20 seconds, and turn it back on. And like everything, you just do all your other machine check. Then, like always, your forums checklist. So your machine, done. Mables, which is your auxiliary equipment, mask, airways, bougie, ETT, limiting scope, and suction. Your monitoring, the standard. And also your meds, which I call the spa drugs, sucks, propofol, atropine, aramine, and adrenaline. Excellent, see you guys next time.